a Wikividi Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Marty Balin Marty Balin was an American singer, songwriter, and musician best known as the founder and one of the lead singers and songwriters of Jefferson Airplane and Jefferson Starship. Early Life Balin was born Martin Jarrell Buckwald in Cincinnati, Ohio, the son of Catherine Eugenia, Jean, and Joseph Buckwald. His paternal grandparents emigrated from Eastern Europe. His father was Jewish, and his mother was Episcopalian. Buckwald attended Washington High School in San Francisco, California. Early musical work In 1962, Buckwald changed his name to Marty Balin and began recording with Challenge Records, releasing the singles, Nobody But You, and I Specialize in Love. By 1964, Balin was leading a folk music quartet called The Town Criers. Jefferson Airplane Balin was the primary founder of Jefferson Airplane, which he launched from a restaurant-turned-club he created and named The Matrix and was also one of its lead vocalists and songwriters from 1965 to 1971. In the group's famous 1966-1971 iteration, Balin served as colleague vocalist alongside Grace Slick and rhythm guitarist Paul Kantner. While his output diminished after surrealistic pillow as Slick, Kantner, and lead guitarist Yorma Kaukonen matured as songwriters, his most enduring songwriting contributions, which were often imbued with a romantic, pop-oriented lilt that was atypical of the band's characteristic forays into psychedelic rock, include, Common Back to Me, Today, and Again with Kantner, the topical 1969 Top 100 hit, Volunteers. Although uncharacteristic of his oeuvre, the uptempo, three-fifths of a mile in ten seconds, and, Plastic Fantastic Lover, remained integral components of the airplane's live set throughout the late 1960s. Balin played with Jefferson Airplane at the Monterey Pop Festival in 1967 and at the Woodstock Festival in 1969. In December 1969, Balin was knocked unconscious by members of the Hells Angels Motorcycle Club while performing during the infamous Altamont Free Concert, as seen in the 1970 documentary film Gimme Shelter. In April 1971, he formally departed Jefferson Airplane after breaking off all communication with his bandmates following the completion of their autumn 1970 American tour. He elaborated upon this decision in a 1993 interview with Jeff Tamark in the Relix. Balin remained active in the San Francisco Bay Area rock scene, managing and producing an album for the Berkeley-based sextet Grutner before briefly joining funk-inflected hard rock ensemble Bodacious DF as lead vocalist on their eponymous 1973 debut album. The following year, Kantner asked Balin to write a song for his new airplane offshoot group, Jefferson Starship. Together, they wrote the early power ballad, Caroline, which appeared on the album Dragonfly with Balin as guest lead vocalist. Jefferson Starship Rejoining the team he had helped to establish, Balin became a permanent member of Jefferson Starship in 1975. Over the next three years, he contributed to and sang lead on four top 20 hits, including, Miracles, With Your Love, Jesse Beres, Count On Me, and N.Q. Dewey's, Runaway. Ultimately, Balin's relationship with the band was beleaguered by interpersonal problems, including Slick's long-standing alcoholism and his own reluctance toward live performances. He abruptly left the group in October 1978 shortly after Slick's departure from the band. Solo work, and reunion projects In 1979, Balin produced a rock opera entitled Rock Justice, about a rock star who was put in jail for failing to produce a hit for his record company. Based on his experiences with the lawsuits fought for years with former Jefferson Airplane manager Matthew Katz, the cast recording was produced by Balin, but it did not feature him in performance. Balin continued with Emmy as a solo artist and in 1981 he released his first solo album, Balin, featuring two Jesse Bearish songs that became top 40 hits, Hearts, and Atlanta Lady. There was in 1983 a second solo album, Lucky, along with a Japan-only EP produced by Emmy called There's No Shoulder. 
Barlin's contract with ME ended shortly thereafter. In 1985, he teamed with Paul Kantner and Jack Cassidy to form the KBC Band. After the breakup of the KBC Band, a 1989 reunion album and tour with Jefferson Airplane followed. Balin continued recording solo albums in the years following the reunion, and reunited with Kantner in the latest incarnation of Jefferson Starship. Balin had intended to record lead vocals for two tracks for Jefferson Starship's album, Jefferson's Tree of Liberty. However, his up touring schedule conflicted with studio sessions, and instead, the track, Maybe For You, from the German release of Windows of Heaven, was included. On July 2, 2007, the music publishing firm Bicycle Music Incorporated announced that it had acquired an interest in songs written or performed by Balin, including hits from his days with Jefferson Airplane and Jefferson Starship. Personal Life Balin enjoyed painting all his life. He painted many of the most influential musicians of the last half of the 20th century. Marty Barlin's atelier is located at 130 King Fine Art in St. Augustine, Florida. Barlin's permanent signature collection gallery. Balin resided in Florida and San Francisco with his wife, Susan Joy Balin, formerly Susan Joy Finkelstein. Together, they had Barlin's daughters Jennifer Edwards and Delaney Balin, and Susan's daughters Rebecca Geyer and Mariah Geyer. Jennifer was born later in the year of his 1963 marriage to Victoria Martin. Balin married Karen Deal, Delaney's mother, in 1989. Karen died in 2010. While on tour in March 2016, Balin was taken to Mount Sinai Beth Israel Hospital in New York City after complaining of chest pains. After undergoing open-heart surgery, he was transferred to an intensive care unit to spend time recovering. In a subsequent lawsuit, Balin alleged that neglect and inadequate care facilities on the hospital's behalf had resulted in a paralyzed vocal cord, loss of his left thumb and half of his tongue, bed sores, and kidney damage. Brought to you by Wikividi Documentaries Would you like to know more?